Everyone's life is built on a spiritual foundation. Many, however, will never take the time to inspect their foundation to see what it's really made of or the ground on which it is built until it's too late. Living on the spiritual basis, our work begins with inspecting our foundation. For without a strong foundation, well-placed, no structure, spiritual or otherwise, however finely constructed, will stand against the inevitable storms, trials, and tribulations that come for all. Speaking in high terms, affirmations, and glowing assumptions is easy when the sun rides high and the river's low and the breeze gentle. Why do hard things like building on high rock, which requires commitment and forethought, when there are easy things like building on loose soil close to water? But as the inevitable storm clouds of living gather, the rushing waters of fear rising, the winds of perceived loss and resentment beginning to whip, it becomes clear that a spiritual foundation built on sweet-sounding rhetoric and little real action is unsound. As the storm intensifies and the structure begins to fail, the foundation crumbling in the ever-growing maelstrom, what will we do? Seek solid spiritual ground and shelter from the storm? or be swept away by fear and desperation. Now, had we first built on solid spiritual ground, a great deal of suffering could have been avoided. So, when was the last time you inspected your spiritual foundation for materials and location? If work and relocation is required, this is much easier to accomplish on calm days rather than stormy. So, set to work while the sun shines. So when the next storm comes, for there is always another, you will not only be prepared, but you will be able to provide help and solace to those who failed to inspect their foundation before the winds and the rains began to blow. My name is Vincent Lee Jones. You can find my writings and videos on Blogger. Title of the page, Living in Spirit. If you search Vincent Lee Jones, you can find them on YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, and Vimeo as well, and on Facebook at Miracles of Recovery. Have a blessed day.